India, celebrating 75th year of independence, is known for its culture and tradition. Marriages, events and other cultural activities have been an integral part of our society. Planning marriages has been some of the very fun activities in every house in India. We have been adorning the place with flowers, serving the guest with lavish food and enjoying the day with full gusto and zeal. But what after the marriages? It leads to a huge wastage of decoratives, flowers, disposals, food, etc. More than a 10 million marriages take place in a year in India and more than that, it generates huge amount of waste. We identified the need to make our marriages and events more sustainable and here is where Utsav comes in. We identified that floral waste has been a major output of the marriages in our country. Around 8 lakh tons of floral waste is produced in the country with marriages being a major player in doing so. Hence, we aim to make the marriages more sustainable by converting the floral waste into useful products like dyes, decoratives, colors, etc. And so is our business model. We aim to collaborate with decorators, NGOs and marketers. We will be facilitating the supply of flowers from decorators to NGOs and other places wherein we have marginalized communities to work with us. We would be then training and upskilling the women from marginalized communities in NGOs and some backward districts of Sonipat. We will then pay them appropriate wages and also buy the entire produce from them so as to ensure fair price for products and fair wages for the service and then market the products. We would also be training the women in marketing so that in future they have that skill as well. Believing in partnership for goals, we partner with Phones and Petals, which has been a major wedding planner and flower provider of the country with more than 500 weddings a year alone in Delhi, with which we aim to kickstart with. We have been in touch with various NGOs and primarily look towards Kul Meher to start our collaboration with. They have been involved in employing women, waste pickers, have a, and are also in, employed in the same industry as we are. Further, for the marketers, we aim to collaborate with Dastakar, Gudorth, Ayatokri, so as to facilitate the sales of our products and also train women who will learn those skills. We ensure our funding through our inactive funds of 10,000 rupees, the sustainability conclave that will teach young youth about social enterprises aimed to raise 50,000 rupees and Phones and Petals as a part of their CSR initiative has agreed to sponsor flowers, logistics and training of women in our project. Setting up partnerships, we aim to regulate this process by 2025, wherein without our intervention, the process will continue and the entire floral waste produced will be converted into useful products. Till now, we have successfully established certain collaborations and have conducted experiments at houses, making the efforts of gold and expertise and from various NGOs. We will achieve so. sustainable development goals of decent work and economic growth by employing women from marginalized society, reducing the floral disposal into water and the chemical substances like synthetic dyes, we will be saving life below water. The methane released from rotting flowers will be reduced, thereby contributing towards the SDG of climate action. Finally, we aim to fulfill responsible consumption and production for events, starting off with a recyclable floral economy. Let's celebrate the Utsav of sustainability. Thank you.